The Flex 20300 series lifter for manual bucket rotate and clamping. Uh, the lifter does have the standard features on it. The two button hand control, the electric up down. When you... This is the Lifto Flex 20300 with anodized and stainless steel components. This is the standard lifter that will be used for the bucket handling. The lifter has the three position brake for lock position, freewheeling motion, and also directional lock for straight line operation. It has a two button hand control for electrically operating the up and down features of the lifter. It's very easy to use, mobile, low built legs that will be used to handle the buckets. Annual clamp and rotate bucket handling attachment. This is the strap that will be used to secure the bucket. As you can see, we've put the rubber friction piece on there to help secure the bucket safely. There are multiple positions that will be used for the different diameter buckets. And then there is a manual clamp that squeezes the strap against the bucket, securing it to the unit. The unit is set up for rotate as well. From either side, there is a non-locking detent so that if the operator lets go of the pin, the unit will stop and not rotate freely. Various uh, diameter and height buckets that will be used by the manual clamp. The first bucket on top there is slid onto the tray. You then take the strap and locate the correct size hook, secure it, and then use the clamping handle to tighten the drum on the end tooling. The unit is now ready to get the clamping of a filled bucket. The lifter is moved into position and raised to the correct height. The bucket can then be slid onto the platform. And as shown before, the clamping strap will be wrapped around and put on the correct hook. And then squeeze the handle to secure the bucket onto the platform. We also have on here a safety catch for the upper part of the bucket that was requested. This unit slides down and hooks over the top of the bucket to help secure it in case of a loose strap. Of the bucket, move the lifter into position, lock the brake, come around to the side and release the detent while pouring the bucket. You have to keep the detent released. Now pour it out. The bucket can also be locked in any position there for scooping. So the operator can come around to the side and scrape out the bucket for the operation. This can be done from either side of the lifter as it's set up for right hand or left hand pour. As you can see, the bucket can be left in that position so the operator can remove any excess material. Safety kit, that catch that will be added to the final design of the bucket. There will be a, a rod that allows adjustment for the different height buckets and the, unit, the clip will slide over the edge of the bucket and secure against it. So for pouring it adds an extra safety feature in case the bucket decides to slip.